How's it going, people? You know who it is. It's your boy, Twix96, people. Uh, this is going to be a different type of video. I know you guys are going to be seeing some Be a Pro action against the New York Rangers here in the background, but um, we're going to step it back a little and talk because this this subject i guess you could say has been it's been it's been bothering me but then again it's it's it's, it's, it's a confusing thing let me say that it just kind of getting to realize some things but uh you know with my old youtube channel i mean the fame of 200 subscribers you're not going to get that much hate really I mean, people are going to comment on your videos and they're going to be like, this was shit, that was shit. But I mean, when people are commenting on my videos, like, you guys know, you can tell I'm a, I'm a better goalie now than I was when I started playing the game in NHL 13. But people like commenting on my videos that are like from September, they're like, ear dust. Those don't bother me because I personally know I was not good. When the game came out, I know I was not good when the game came out. So, I mean, when people say that, that doesn't bother me. But when people are are coming on to my videos now, like here, I'll, I'll go read this comment right now uh, on my one video here. Just look at it quickly. Um, I don't think it was this one. I think it was like 55 or something. But uh, people are like, when I when I um when I make videos on YouTube. I'm just trying to have fun. I am not taking any of this extremely seriously. I am not trying to do anything like I'm not making crazy money. I'm not making. I'm barely making any money. But I mean, people are like you're copying Neil Bridges. I mean, that's that's one that's one video right there. Um, people, a lot of people say, "Oh, you're copying this guy. You're copying that guy." Shut up. I'm just trying to have some fun, and if I had to bring other YouTubers, um, little catchy things into my videos, so be it. I mean, if you if you have a problem with me making a video and adding something I enjoy because I'm just trying to have fun in this game, so be it. So be it. Look, look, look at this. I'm just looking at the comments on uh, Be a Pro episode 57. Uh, this guy says, "Don't copy QJB or KSI. You're cooler than them." I know, I know, I'm cooler than them, but. I don't. I don't care what. I, like, I'm not saying I don't. I don't care what you guys say. I know you guys want to see different stuff, but I mean, those are like pretty much. If you guys look at the channels I'm subscribed to, I'm only subscribed to about ten channels because a lot of gaming channels on the YouTube uh, scene pisses me off. And I mean, it's all the same stuff. Like you know, those channels like Nova and stuff. But I mean, QJB, Chris Smooth. Um, I don't watch that much Anto to Boss anymore, but KSI, uh, Mr. Technical Difficult, Comedy Shorts Gamer, Duke the Killer, that's pretty much the only channels, oh, and Bacon Country, so, but if you're watching this, Bacon Country, I-L-Y, <laughs> um, but that is, that's pretty much all I'm, guys, that's all I'm subscribed to, I'm only subscribed to about 8, 9 channels on YouTube, I mean, I remember I used to watch White Boy and, like, all this crap, and I mean, it just, there just comes a po point in, someone's video experiences like when you know this is the same crap over and over and I just don't like seeing the same stuff over and over I don't know if you guys think it's the same stuff over and over when you're watching my videos I mean tell me if you feel that because I try to mix it up uh, I have different different series I know that it's not like every every uh, every upload it's a different one but I mean when I do a video upload, I do them in like huge bu uh, bunches. I mean, like I'm just going through my videos right now. I would upload a whole bunch of Via Pros, and then I uploaded a whole bunch of um, Hockey Ultimate Teams, and then I uploaded a couple of uh, uh, GM modes, and then a couple of Hockey Ultimate Team, and then back to the Via Pros. I mean, I try to mix it up a little bit, but I mean, when I run out of videos, because what I do, guys, I <coughs> I don't record video to video. I sit down, have a nice little session, and uh, I. Uh, I record a whole load of videos like this is the last one you guys are seeing right now of my seven videos or something like that but um, we're getting off topic here um getting back to uh the comments i mean definitely like i was just telling you guys don't copy qjb or q uh ksi um someone else was just like you watch too much nba 2k13 videos it's a bit annoying if it's a bit annoying why are you, i <sighs> I cannot wrap my fingers around why you people are 
uh, it, it's just it's, it's something it's hard to explain what I think because like it's it, uh, it's hard to explain guys when you don't have an audience as big not as many people hate on you for the small things like when I, I'll give you an example when I make my videos I'll be like I'll someone will someone will get a goal or someone will, I'll make a save sorry I'll make a save I'll be like get the easy save or something like that or get the easy goal and then people are like oh you're copying QJB you know what get him off YouTube right now no you I, this is what I don't get the pe and especially the people who are commenting this are like 13 year old kids 10 year old kids who have two subscribers on YouTube. What is wrong with society that these little kids think they could come in and, you know, they're basically bullies. They're online bullies hiding behind a username. They they would never say this to someone's face. I don't know. I got nothing to say about that. That, that, that just kind of makes me laugh because especially, you guys, when I see these comments from people, they're less respective people. Like, these kids who comment on my videos and they're like, Oh, you're copying this person, that person. I go into. I always do this. Whenever someone comments junk on me, I want to go to the channel and see what they got. If someone's commenting on my stuff and they got more subscribers than me, they got a more respective view count, they got more respective uh, subscriber base than me. I'll take. I'll take their stuff into consideration, even if they have like a hundred subs and they're actually trying at YouTube. I'll give them consideration. But when kids. Who just make? Uh, I'm I'm saying kids because I have a lot of subscribers on my channel that are between the ages of I'd say 15 and up. They don't comment shit on my videos. They they look at this. I want more. Look at this guy. Uh, I want more. Be a pro. I'm loving the series. Um, what's more guys? More hut. More hockey ultimate team. Uh, yo Twix, you should do some more sub shootouts. Uh, please help me with be a pro. That's just one video, and then you get the kids. Who are trying to make you, you know, they're trying to piss you off and make you quit. It just makes me laugh because, I mean, where's this? I gotta find this guy's channel. Um, when, when, this, this is what, this is what always makes me remember why I'm doing this. When these kids cop, uh, comment this stuff, I see this kid right here. Um, I'm not gonna mention his name, but he's like, he's like, um, why are you copying Neil Bridges? I go to his channel. Psh, on his channel, let's see. Two subscribers, 58 total video views. I'm not hating. I'm saying people all start somewhere, but I look at his sub box. Who does he got in his sub box? He's got Nova. He's got C Nanners, Chris Smooth, QJB. He's got all these people with over a million, like a million. These guys are like, he, all he has in his sub box is guys who have huge amount of subscriber counts. Why are you hating on? <laughs> I th thank you for realizing the fact that I'm using their stuff. Um, if you check my subscriptions, you notice, and the only people's content, and I'm not trying to steal it from them. That's the thing. I'm not trying to steal it from people. I'm just referring to it because I enjoy it, and I'm trying to make my videos fun. I'm not trying to set a piss ass attitude here, but I'm just trying to say, man, people are saying you're copying. If you consider copying, let it be. I'm just implementing things that I like in watching my videos and making my videos fun. That's all I'm saying, guys. And uh, with that being said, when I got this comment uh, yesterday on my video, this this comment right here made me remember that you don't you can't give a shit what these people say you can't give a shit what these kids who say you're copying this that it's not only the jealousy but once you start growing on youtube you're gonna get the hate i already know that it's kind of sounding repetitive from what i've been saying from the start but when baking country um a man of a man of almost 5,000 subscribers comments on my video a person with 500 subs you know i've been working hard at this guy since september I've grown my channel. Like I mean, lately I've been growing. Like, I've been, I've been rocket shooting. Like from 300. Once I hit the 300 mark, I've been growing huge in the past few months. But um, Bacon Country comments on my video. I love to add you, but you steal my position. I started tech, uh, talking to him on uh, on Twitter and such, 
and I mean he's such a great a great person and uh, you know it, it, it really helps out when uh, you have people who are huge like in the NHL community the biggest guy in the NHL community is Nasher or if you consider a day-to-day -day average NHL only uploading content guy Nasher is definitely the man of the hour QJB you gonna chirp me for that now uh, but definitely Nash is the biggest guy in the community then Bacon Country I'd say is the second biggest guy in the community but I mean when I get those comments from someone who's the, like the biggest anarchies in my kind of genre NHL 13 genre that makes me feel like I'm doing something right when Bacon Country's comment on my videos when I messaged um, iPod King Carter 100k subs uh, for the selection Sunday March uh, best commentator March Madness sports commentator March Madness when he says my video was pretty good and I missed the cut by one vote because there were so many people to choose from that tells me that I'm doing something right so I'm gonna try to wrap this up when haters tell me stuff I don't take it personally because if if they're if they're if they're just one of those kids who makes a YouTube account and just comments on it because they want to piss people off, that cause that's what YouTube has come to. It just become basically online a video bullying website. When it comes to that, no one gives a shit, guys. No one gives a shit. If, you realize those guys who have like a hundred k plus subs. Those people who hate on them don't do anything to them. And that's what I haven't realized really because I've always been stuck in the mindset of kind of like, I got to listen to everyone, what they say. Because when I did my YouTube thing on my other channel for three years, if you only get 200 subs in three years, you don't think much of your channel. And I get where these kids are coming from hating. Their frustration boils up. They make about five videos. They get one view on each video. I get what I get the frustration because I was at that point at one time. You have to realize in YouTube what you want to do, and you want to you you gotta do the best stuff you can, guys. And that's why I try to put best effort I can into all my videos. And now I gotta edit this video clip. It's almost like 12 minutes. I've never gone on a rampage ramble like this, guys. But I mean, it's just something I had to bring up because it's it's just happening every video. If I want to implement something from another YouTube video maker, I, help me if it's a sin to uh, say a couple of words that are not even copyrighted. Um, from another youtuber into my videos help help me if, if there's something wrong with doing that just for the entertainment purpose just for uh, you know having a little bit of a fun time help me guys <laughs> honestly I got nothing to say about that but we get our asses spanked by the uh, New York Rangers here guys not a good game not a good topic guys but you know what I'll see you next time I'm out